Hi, Stan Stans. My name is Dan. Welcome to the world of Extra. It has been three whole years since I did my last convenience store video. And you guys have been nothing but hungry for some more convenience store content. And to that I say... Clap if you feel, feel safe. <laughs> oh. No one. <laughs> well... Okay, I'll do it. But of course I have seen 12 people in my clownery. And who better co-star than the only person gayer than me? First stop is 7-Eleven. So we took our gay asses to the near 7-Eleven. A lot of you gay people probably use iced coffee as your fuel. But I'm just so quirky and built different, so coffee gives me heart attacks in the morning. So I rely on these Japanese vitamin shots and energy jellies. And breakfast is honestly such an exciting meal. And there's endless possibilities in 7-Eleven. Oh look, the viral Y1000. Chicken roll. Wow, they even have Korean options. It's honestly insane the amount of cup noodle choices they have. Chocolate bank. Oh my god, I literally just want to get every single thing. Here's the total for breakfast. Ah, ah. we're back from 7-Eleven and we got a bunch of things. <laughs> so, we are gonna have breakfast. What's your main dish, Dewey? My main dish is chicken roll. Can you see it? Protein filled chicken roll. <laughs> My main dish is <laughs> Ingredients stewed in broth. That could be anything. Ingredients stewed in broth? Bon appetit to me. <laughs> Not every not every convenience store food is just ready to eat. This one, you actually have to heat it up with a pot. It said you have to put water and put this like that in the pot. Not this requiring labor. I'm a YouTuber. I don't know what labor is. Anyway, while this is boiling, let's just start with the mukbang. We're Tokyo boys on the go. Of course, we're gonna rely on beverages for sustenance. We're Tokyo boys on the go. Of course, I'm gonna survive the disgusting, the disgusting taste, taste of these, of these jellies. jellies. Bitch! If you guys have watched any convenience store videos, you guys will know about Y1000. Apparently, this is very sought after. It's so rare. But literally, I think I'm being tricked because every single time I go to any convenience store, they have this. Not at the Lawson that I went to the other day that I went there. Shut up. <laughs> My drink is called Energy, energy Management. management. Stewie, I think there are other things you have to manage more than your energy. Like time. <laughs> I think I should have the energy shot first. This is called Chokora BB, and a lot of Japanese people swear by this, including me. It says here, Tsurai tsukare ni. Yowatta karada ni. So that's when you're just like really tired, low on energy, and your body feels a little weak. <laughs> Don't cut me off. Happy breakfast! Cheers, Cheers to, to that! that. It, smells it smells like pussy like juice. juice. I love it. I love it. Wait, it tastes like banana. Oh. <laughs> it tastes like banana if you dip it in paint. This one tastes like nutrition, aka battery acid. I mean, it's fine, I'll drink it. It sucks. It's fucking horrible. Anyway. Sugar, 90% off. Oh. And what? You're supposed to splenda to give people, give cancer? people cancer? cancer? Hell. Also, today there's just a lot of foods and drinks with really weird names. We got this one that says Chocolate Bank. What the fuck? <laughs> Girl, you ate. <laughs> to me earlier, was like, is that dairy though? I don't want that. It's literally soy milk, and I'm actually really surprised. Me too. I thought it would be like cow's milk. Yeah. Chocolate Bank. Wow. Wow. That smells so chocolate tea. <laughs> Cheers, Cheers to that. that! Okay, here's the thing. If you guys have had any of the Yakult's, because literally they have like 50,000 different Yakult's, this one tastes like every single other one. Y1000, I don't know what's special about it, but apparently it gets rid of stress. I drink it every day. Do I look stressed? Yeah. <laughs> What the hell? Yeah! Oh my god, what the hell? Now this is a chocolate burger. You guys, it's so hard to find good chocolate drink in Japan because everything is just dairy and obviously I'm lactose and talented. This chocolate bank, girl, this company better be making bank because they really ate with this concoction. It tastes like Chucky. <gasps> oh, oh my god, we just discovered Chucky but soy milk because I love Chucky. You guys know the Filipino drink, Chucky? That was my childhood. 7-Eleven, you guys, chocolate bank. You guys have to try it. Especially god. if you're lactose and talented. <sighs> <laughs> oh my god, you guys. Do not burp with this mixture. It literally tastes like I was eating, I was someone's, eating someone's ass. For my main dish, obviously, I got the ingredient stewed in broth. This is actually odeng. If you've ever been to Korea or Japan, you guys know what odeng is. It's pretty much just like... Ingredients ingredient stewed, stewed in, in the broth. In the broth. <laughs> you know what? You guys ate. <laughs> Whoa. 
Ooh. By ingredients, they mean like fish cakes, radish, a whole egg. boiled egg. Do you guys like this? This is konjac jelly. It's elephant yam. In the winter, when you go to like festivals and stuff, Japanese people eat this. It's a very simple flavor. I think it's fish broth. And honestly, this is the perfect way to warm up in the winter when you're outside. I don't know what possessed me to get some more soup after Oden, but I was shook, you guys. I swear, Japan did not believe in non-dairy options until like what today? Because after the soy chocolate bank, sesame and soy milk soup. This this has never been done. Every single soup is like dairy. Maybe you guys aren't as shook as I am because I live in Japan and you guys probably have this already. Like, oh, soup, of course it's soy milk. Duh, Stan. Why are you so fucking sexy and hot and so handsome? Why are you just like the smartest person in the world? And why are you just so rich? You're such a trillionaire and you manifest anything you want. You are just, you so, are just sexy. so sexy. Everyone's sexy. in love with you. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> I know that's right. Smells like my professor's fingers. <laughs> Chalkboard. That's what I meant. What did, what did you think? Did you think he was fingering me? <laughs> but first you put the soy powder, I guess, and then you put the miso. I know a lot of you guys are like, oh my god, Japanese soup? Miso soup. Do you guys even know what miso is made of? Alexa, what's miso made of? <laughs> miso is a type of fermented soybean paste that is commonly used in Japanese cuisine and a fermented mold called Aspergillus orizae. <laughs> It honestly looks really yummy. <sighs> okay, to finish our breakfast, we have dessert. We saw this chocolate filling donuts at the cash register, and we just had to get it. I'm just so intrigued by how fluffy and soft it looks. How? <laughs> wow. Shit. <laughs> wow. This is like the solid version of the drink. Mmm. Delectable. Anyway, that's it for breakfast. We are gonna have a special guest for lunch and another special guest for dinner, so stay tuned. Let's get on with our day. Let's, Let's go. go. We are in Shinjuku Station to meet up with Kenzo for lunch. Which convenience store should we go to next? Should we do Family Mart? Let's do Family Mart. Let's go to Family Mart. Where the fuck is Kenzo? So we met up with Kenzo in Shinjuku and we decided to do Family Mart for our next meal. Right off the bat, the desserts look so yummy. I was honestly so close to just doing a dessert mukbang. But salad first, as the world of actual lore says. I'm doing reduced sodium dressing today so I don't get a heart attack from all these convenience store food I'm eating. And this honestly really shook moi because I've never seen these before. Uh, oh, well, tell me why these gay ass bitches are getting alcohol at noon. <laughs> Japanese people are finally catching on to the fact that they're all lactose intolerant. So wow, oat chocolate milk and oat milk tea. Family Mart honestly just has the best food recently. So many new stuff as well. And uh, oh, here's a total for lunch. And of course, we had to make our melon frappuccino with a machine. I actually don't know if this is available in every single Family Mart because I've personally never seen this before. But it's definitely interesting. It doesn't quite look the most appetizing, but we'll be the judge of that. Our lunch venue of today is Shinjuku Yoai, my favorite park in the world. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. Okay, so we made it to Shinjuku Yoai. They said no YouTube videos allowed. Okay. We got so many good stuff today, you guys. Okay, salad first as usual. Fresh vegetable salad. Wow. The dressing I got, it says reduced sodium Japanese dressing. Shibuya and Kenzo got <laughs> this. <laughs> they love torture, so they just got something unappetizing. Cheers! Cheers. 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 Yeah. Okay, okay, smell it. If you guys want to know the smell, turn off your fridge and leave it like that for like three days and then smell the inside <laughs> of your fridge. Mmm, mm, that's so fresh. Fresh from the factory. <laughs> What's your review? Just a little bit exaggerated, but to put it in perspective, you let a cabbage rot in the fridge for a little bit, and then you give that to the factory, and then they put a lot of chemicals in it, and then they stuff it in a plastic container. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. I'm trying my best to finish this. <laughs> oh my god, my fucking chicken has grass on it. I guess you Joke. call that a lemongrass chicken. This morning you guys remember chocolate bang and it was like soy cocoa. I found oat milk milk tea. Huh? Yeah, oat milk tea. Yes. Oh. From Alpro. Kenzo got double peach lassi. Shout out to India. Oh my god. Girl. Wait, let me open this shit. 
You guys know that cabbage smells like fart? So cabbage in my mouth and like the smell of dog shit <laughs> making me feel like I'm just having a dog shit dog mukbang. Shit. Well, I got a melon frappe. Frappe? Frapp? Frappe? I was actually surprised that they had this too. I thought only 7-Eleven had those like smoothie machines. Cheers, Cheers to that! Oh my people. god! Uh, this aid! Right? That's so good. Wow! Yes! Oh! 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 Hey! Hey! Fuck, it's good. This is. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's Ooh. young, though! It's in it. Try, try this. It. Oh, this is definitely not for our age range. The demographic mm. of this drink is definitely five to seven. Because it tastes like I'm overfeeding a cow with melon and then sucking its taste. <laughs> and then. And going. <laughs> 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 For my oh, main exactly. dish, I'm actually kind of brave today. I got myself takoyaki from the kombini. Kenzo, what did you get? I got a chicken teriyaki don. Whoa, that looks amazing. Right. Wow. Look at that, look at that. Look at it. Wow. Look at it. Yours looks appetizing and that right. makes one of us because... <laughs> <laughs> This looks like my ball sack in the summer. <laughs> Sweaty, Sweaty, soggy, wet, wet, and wrinkly. And wrinkly. <laughs> Wait. I got... I got the clam oh, oh, chowder. Oh, clam, clam soup cream pasta. It's giving seashell seashells by the seashore. She <laughs> she she sells sells seashells. No, clam. <laughs> clam, clam soup, soup cream pasta. pasta. Clam soup cream pasta. Itadakimasu. It tastes exactly how it looks. Yeah. Ball sack? Okay, 10 out of 10. Delish. <laughs> it's not very clam chowdery ball sack out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I generally love this though. I think Japanese convenience stores have a way of making foods that don't normally taste good refrigerated taste good. Yeah. Like gyoza. How would you rate your takoyaki? So if 10 is festival takoyaki and 1 is convenience store takoyaki, I would rate it a 1. <laughs> <laughs> no, but this, I would honestly rate it like a 6. It's a good 6. Takoyaki is just so good fresh because it's like so nice and yeah, puffy. And good boy. Girl, don't good boy me. I'm gonna bottom if you say that. <laughs> Obviously, takoyaki isn't enough for me, so I decided to get myself this sweet and spicy chicken. Bah. I would rate this one a 10 out of 10. Wait, I haven't tried it. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, oh my god. Girl, I don't know what possessed me to get so much food, but I got myself a onigiri as well. It's the, uh, it, yeah, whatever. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I got this onigiri. I've actually never seen this one before, but it's really soggy, so I'm kind of scared. This one is tarako, which is fish egg, plus salmon. Which, those are my two favorite flavors in Onigiri, so I decided to get it. Look at her. Girl, outfit of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Strong flavors. Stewie's definitely gonna hate this. Ah! Oh my god, it's so fishy. We're gonna do our dessert. What you gotta, what What's you this? gotta do with the dessert? Girl, shut up. I don't know about you guys, but eating convenience store all day is scaring me. So I decided to prepare and I'm getting this digestion drink. This is for hangover and when you overeat. Is there such thing as overeating? Oh, there's such thing as disgusting drink. I'll tell you that. <laughs> what does it smell like? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> On grinder, sucking dick every night. Aye. <laughs> I, we're just smelling it. Fuck. <laughs> oh my well. god, it's so bitter. <gasps> oh my god, that's the worst thing I've ever had in my life. You guys, the fucking cake. cake you can cake, see it. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. <laughs> if I were to eat just one thing for the rest of my life, it wouldn't be this. We also got another dessert. This one said Taiwan steamed cake. Oh, oh. Well, that, mm. I swear, like earlier. Ugh. Honestly, it tastes so good. Oh, that's yeah, so good. Man. I can taste like the brown sugar aftertaste. I lied. Finally, we have this. You guys know that my favorite when I was a university student was the chocolate version of this. This was my first time seeing this, but it looked amazing. Like white chocolate version of it. Wow. What the fuck? Mm. <laughs> That's so good. 
You can taste like the sweet corn. Girl, shut up. <laughs> it tastes like this. I would rate this meal honestly a good 7.44298865432319244896214928921 Out of 10.0 oh. I rate it an 8 <laughs> I would rate it a good It's dinner time What better place to buy dinner than Lawson Lawson Loki is like the mother of all convenience stores You guys know the drill We're here picking up things we've never gotten before I don't know why I feel like every single time I go to a convenience store I'm always so inclined to buy dessert first thing Look at the amount of soups they had Especially these ones that said one meal worth of vegetables Just casually raw beef in a bag that you eat as is Didn't know Japan sells hot water in a bottle S'more star definitely trying that Total for dinner Just heating everything up in their industrial grade microwave So it heats up in like one Second. Ah, it's dinner time, and our special guest tonight is. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Steven. It is currently 8 30 p.m. I think that's perfect time for dinner. So far, still be eating on the convenience store today. How do you feel? I feel. Just. I'm gonna be honest, I've done this before. <laughs> On a normal day, not as a challenge. Yeah. <laughs> it worked, okay, what did you get? Spicy soup. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Okay, we're gonna explain what we got as we go. So, what should we start with? I'm gonna start with taco wasabi. I'm gonna start with a salad first, as per uh, usual. Salad first, with no the crunch. Mine is shrimp and egg pasta salad. It has spaghetti at the bottom. You guys, is this normal in your country? Like, what the- what? I don't know! Work. I know you guys would never get this if it were you. Wait, why is there barely anything in there? But slime. But slime. <laughs> but slime. <laughs> slime from the butt. Bon appetit! Holy fuck! What, what, why does it smell like that? Oh my god. <coughs> I bet this is gonna be yummy based on how it smells. Because I love natto and natto smells like feet. But this one honestly smells like wasabi. This is octopus, by the way. How do I eat this even? Oh my god, torture. Torture I answer. Oh, it's so salty, spicy, sweet, all at the same time. And oceany. It's insane, but this would be amazing with rice. It's sweet. Mmm. Wait, not as bad as I thought it was, but still not good. Ah! This is no, a 10 it's out of 10. Good. It's delicious. <laughs> what a baby, what a child. You only like what? Dick. You got that right. This tea is with four ingredients. Pearl barley, blended wholesome barley, rice and corn. And water, so not four. <laughs> <laughs> also, blended wholesome barley. Wholesome barley, who the fuck are you talking oh, about? Oh, the funk tomato. <laughs> <laughs> Just as I thought, tastes like barley tea. Also, they thought they did something with this, like a healthy drink. This is literally just barley tea. Everything they're saying here, like they're flexing, is just barley tea though. No, 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 it's not just any barley tea. It's wholesome barley. <laughs> Fuck me, bitch. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try the salad with Nuda Crunch. Nuda Crunch is basically this Filipino <laughs> snack. It's basically uncooked noodles. Kids buy it and they like, crush it in a bit of powder. Mmm! Really? It's so good. Yeah, I love that. Girl, calm down. Best salad ever! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe this is like an easy way to eat salad because I know a lot of guys hate salad. <laughs> okay, let me try my spaghetti salad. Why are you kind of good? So basically, it's just spaghetti with vegetables, right? Yeah, like cold mm. spaghetti. Yeah. One day worth of vegetable soup. And I want to see like how healthy it actually is. It smells like curry. Five grams of protein and uh, one day worth of vegetables. Wait, no. It's shokubun no yasai, so one meal worth of vegetables. Oops. So useless. Okay, one meal worth of vegetables, my bad. And the name is Odoroki Cup Soup. Shocking cup of soup. <laughs> Maybe I'll be shocked by how plasticky it will taste. Like. <laughs> okay, I'm full. Yeah, you're a fool. 
<laughs> so what is this? Spicy wonton soup. Steven got this because he has been having pollen allergy all day and his nose is stuffed. So he thinks this will clear him out. Douching, but for your nose. <laughs> oh, there's wonton. Whoa, look at this. The one time. Uh, oh my god. Red. It's so red. This is gonna be spicy. It's gonna be like one of those Korean food spicy. Oh my god. It's literally like blood red. Artificial coloring. I'm going to open my hamburger steak bento. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I just wanted to try their little hamburger steak because it has lions on it and it looks interesting. Uh, excuse me! <laughs> okay, so while waiting for this, let's try the omurais. My main dish is this little tiny one because I'm just kind of sick of eating convenience store food all day. So I had to get this tiny little bento. Look how delectable that looks. I love pork that looks like this. If you guys love pork, you guys would know. Fatty, thin, brown, perfect. Juicy, mouth watering, thick, veiny, eight inches. I pull <laughs> ripping, throbbing <laughs> cock. cock. Why are you gay? Who says I'm gay? You are transgender. This looks amazing. Look at that. Wow. Wait, I'm kind of jealous. Brown sauce. <laughs> Wait, I know it though. Like parang curry, na gravy. <laughs> so confusing. It's like furry, but if you added like a bucket <coughs> of tap water. Take a mess. Mmm. Tastes artificial. I think too much sauce. Mmm, I like this. This is good, but I feel like it's been sitting on the shelf for a little too long, so it's a little dry and a little hard. Hard! I'm gonna try the omenizer. Okay. It's taking me somewhere. It's definitely not a good place. <laughs> I think there's something missing in its flavor. But also, it's so wet with this. Yeah, it's so wet. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's not enough flavor because it's just like a bunch of tap water, I feel like. <laughs> okay, you guys, calm down. I know it sounds like we've literally just been like dragging a bunch of food today. But I think it's mainly because we are getting things that we wouldn't normally get. So the video is more interesting. Because I feel like if we get the usual things we get, we're just gonna do another mukbang of like delicious foods. I get what you mean <coughs> about the water. I know, right? It yeah. tastes like curry with water. Yeah. <laughs> but it's good. It's definitely on the good side, yeah. but not too far in. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely on the spectrum of tastes. Yeah, it's good because water is good. Yeah. yeah. Favorite drink is water. Yeah. I mean, like, if I were to, like, choose between this or water, I would choose water. <laughs> but it still has a taste. Okay, here's the thing that I've noticed throughout the years with convenience store food. All convenience store foods, every single one, good or bad, will grow on you. Like, as you're eating it, it starts to get better and better. And I think it's the MSG paralyzing your taste buds, but, <laughs> <laughs> but no. <I> <laughs> You keep saying the most amazing lines today. <laughs> <laughs> See, he said he can't finish it, and like as he's eating it, he's like, wait, this is amazing. <laughs> His taste buds are paralyzed. <laughs> okay, now I need my little vegetable soup. Shocking cup soup. Whoa, that's shocking. Whoa, Whoa look at the redness. Yeah. Shocking soup? I'm definitely shocked by the separation of the oil and water. Oh, when you mix it, it gets better. You see the artificial vegetables that they put in this? <laughs> Ooh, it looks so fresh. fresh from the factory. <laughs> <laughs> Genetically modified. <laughs> oh, it tastes like curry. Oh. This is curry soup. Okay, let's go. Karayo. I mean, that will clear your blockages. Everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I'm, I'm hung. Fuck, that's so spicy. Hell. <sighs> now that's wholesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like this. Okay, that's spicy. Oh, it's getting spicier and spicier. Yeah. Shit. Maka shit, but. Best food ever. <laughs> you guys, look at what I found at the convenience store chocolate s'mores tart. Look how amazing that looks. You just put it in the microwave for a few seconds. Oh, oh my god. god. That looks amazing. Oh, Ooh. look. Oh my god, that looked amazing. What the fuck? <laughs> mm, oh my god. 
Wait, why is that amazing? Everything chocolate flavored we had today was good. Mm -hmm. If a man showed up and was like, will you marry me? <laughs> I would fucking say yes. <laughs> if you're not careful, it's gonna look like you just ate ass, so. <laughs> Question, which country do you think Haagen-Dazs is from? Belgium. Or Austria. Haagen-Dazs was made in the USA, and Haagen-Dazs doesn't mean anything. <gasps> What? It doesn't mean anything, and they just named it Hagen Daz, so people think it's foreign. Oh my god, yeah. no. They were like, oh, it's Danish. You know the Danish language doesn't even use this letter or Z and S together. It doesn't mean anything. They're just like, oh, Hagen Daz. It's foreign. Bitch, Hagen Daz a scam. <laughs> So this is just American ice cream. I got the strawberry truffle flavor. Oh wow. It has little bits. Mm, that's yummy. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna drink my drink yogurt vanilla custard. Vanilla custard drink? Oh my god, people drink custard? Yuck drink. <laughs> <laughs> And on the other side of the spectrum of a clogged artery, <laughs> green smoothie. Yeah. Mmm. Okay, okay, I definitely should have shaken, shaken, shaken it. Cause oh it's... my god, that's thick. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Oh, she thick, bitch. Can I try mm. some? I don't know why, but a lot of convenience store food tastes like paint initially. Mm. <laughs> so we got sakura mochi. Ooh. 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 Let's see. Yeah. Jelly like. It doesn't fall. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> it definitely <laughs> not. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, it won't fall. See? Oh, oh wow! wow. <laughs> <laughs> but what the fuck is so yeah, don't suck it. You're gonna suffocate you. It did not leave a dent. <laughs> Self-curing. <laughs> this is a lizard. <laughs> Self-healing. Self-healing lizard. Lizard jelly. <laughs> the fuck am I eating? <laughs> I don't know if it's good or not. Main ingredient, gasoline. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's good. It, it has no texture. It tastes like an imagination. <laughs> yeah. It tastes like nail polish. No, I'm. that's what I'm saying. Like gasoline, <laughs> right? <laughs> But like really delicious gasoline. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys, we would rate this a meal. I would say 7.224 out of 10.224. Maybe 7.5. Uh, 7. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> okay, overall, I would say my favorite meal was lunch, but I feel like that's because we got really good things and because it was family mart. If you guys want us to do more of these convenience store videos, let us know in the comments. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys enjoyed the special guest today. And just let us know what kind of videos you guys want us to make. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys again in my next video next week. Bye! Bye.